welcome to my YouTube channel. This is my second video. This is Nira. Today I am here with a Thread Up unboxing. Um, I had repurchased some stuff about a week ago and I finally got it in and it came in this humongous big box here and I'm gonna do an unboxing for you guys. So if people who don't know what Thread Up is, Thread Up is a secondhand consignment um, online store um, and you can sell your things to them you can purchase things from them or whatnot um, on your first purchase well actually on my first purchase I got 50 not 50 40 percent off every item that I bought um, and the good thing about the things that I bought most of them were new with tags so um, I bought some shoes and clothing so I'm gonna bring out the first item and that is um, a pair of Sam Edelman uh, sandals and these look like they are brand new. I have butterfingers. I'm dropping everything. So anyways, look at the sole on these. They look like they're brand new. And then here you go. And these are so cute. And these, you know, Sam Edelman is not a cheap brand. And um, these are really, really, really nice. And I got these for like $8. Okay. Um, I did order another pair of sandals, but um, they didn't get sent to me. Um, they refunded me the money for um, for whatever, what I paid for them, which was, I think it was like $7 or something like that. Um, and I assume they must, didn't have them or couldn't find them. Who knows? But that's fine. Excuse me. The next um, item that I purchased, um, these are used they are not um new and these are a pair of levi jeans okay and i guess they put their little tags on here in case you want to um maybe return them i don't know but it's it's cute okay and then they are a size 16 and they are boot cut and I bought these because they were only three dollars. I think like three dollars and fifty cents. And me, I like to shop and I don't mind buying secondhand. Okay. Um, the next item I got is a really nice skirt from Rachel Roar. Rachel Roy. And this is new with tags. And it looks like they cut off the original price of this. But um, I got this skirt for like 16 or $16. And this came in a size 1X. And this is the skirt. It has this little split right here. And the material is very thick. And I love navy. Navy's my favorite color. Okay, and then I got a the matching um, little vest to go with it. It's like a sweater material, but really nice, thick. And this is again by Rachel Roy. This is in a zero X, and actually, this came from Macy's. Okay, so the original price on here was $89 and then it was 70% off for $26. I got this top from Thread Up for $9. So, really cute outfit. All right, um, the next item I got was also from Rachel Roy and this was um, new as well with tags. And this was originally $89 and I got this in a size extra large and it is a skirt and it's really cute. Like I said, I love navy and if you saw my first video, I told you I love stripes, sucker for stripes and this is really cute. I say really cute and so cute a lot. All right, my next item. Oh, I didn't tell you how much I got the skirt for. I got the skirt for, I want to say, $12. I'm not sure. They didn't put the price on, um, they didn't put the price on, uh, the invoice that they gave me. Okay, and then I got this, um, Ralph Lauren. 
I guess you want to call it a cardigan sweater and it's in pink it's a size extra large and I got this for ten dollars and it is and you know what it doesn't this it doesn't even smell like it's second hand um, and I love navy it has a little navy do Ralph Lauren on it and I love pink and navy together and this was a great deal oh wow the sweater is so nice okay my next item is a sorry my next item is a next another Rachel Roy um piece and like I said most of the things that I got were new with tags and um it doesn't say the price here but I'm pretty sure it's probably around the $89 mark and this is a dress And this was in a 1X. And I'm trying to figure out which way it goes. Oh, V-neck in the back. Okay. And then it has some little detailing, a little ruching on the side here. Really cute. And then I got this dress. Um, I actually paid a little bit more than my other pieces i believe i got this dress for probably like 20 bucks i want to say okay and then the last item the last item that i got for another pair of shoes and these are some cole han oxfords and i love oxford shoes and they have some pink bottoms so these shoes retail at $200, okay? And I got these for $22. Kohan is one of the most comfortable pair of shoes that I own. I have two other Oxfords like these, but they don't have the same kind of sole. It has the Nike sole at the bottom and it's white rubber and it's so comfortable. I have them in a brown pair and a black pair, but I couldn't pass up on these shoes being that they were $200 got them for 22 okay so that's gonna be it for um, my thread up unboxing and everything that I got in here um, my whole total I got um, let's see one two three four five six seven eight items for uh, $98. That was really good, especially when one item was already $89. Okay, so um, today I went to church this morning um, with my family and then we went out to um, get breakfast afterwards. And where we went in this area, it's called Burlingame, Burlingame, California. We went to a restaurant called Stacks. And um, there's like a little, um, there's a street um, where they have um, all of, like a shopping area, like a, uh, I don't want to say it's a strip mall because it's kind of a little higher end, um, but not high end like Louis Vuitton high end, but they have some, um, a couple stores. There's like a Sephora there, a Banana, um, Republic, Gap, um, J. Crew. there's an Apple store and some other booth. They have, a, I think, I believe they have a Trina Turk store and all that. But anyways, we went into the Gap and I did find some pieces from the Gap that were, um, got some good prices so the first item so like I said I went to the Gap okay and my daughter just bought like a, a hoodie um, from the kids department because she's small and she can fit this kid, kids uh, clothing even though she's 14 so anyways I bought these pants in an extra large and they're like a sculpting sleek so um I guess the whole Gap family, they have come up with this um, sculpting um, brand on their pants. So they have jeans that they kind of sculpt you better. But anyway, these are some really thick, thick pants. They have a zipper on the side. They're black. And then they have this, I guess, faux suede navy blue um, patch here. And then there's zippers on the side. And they are so cute. And I saw these, I think I want to say during Christmas. And the original price on here for these pants were $59. And I got them in the size extra large, like I said. And I got them for, look at that, $5.99. And they fit so good. Do wonders for my butt. Okay. And then I got 
another pair of pants and these were some jeans and um these are in a size 33 which i believe converts to a size 16 because that's what i am and they are a stretch curvy true skinny and they are really have really good stretch they're like an acid um not an acid but you know the wash is not like a true um black denim but there's some distressing right here and what was so cute and what sold me on these pants is they have these little corsets going down just the little ankle part so cute and then of course they have pockets in the back and I got these for the original originally $69 and I got them for $14 you can see that wow there you go, $14. Okay. And then I bought a denim dress. Did I need a denim dress? No, but it was cute. On. Okay. Um, and I got this in a size extra large. And that's like a cute little, kind of like a t-shirt or button-down dress. Really cute. And what I really loved about them, that it had pockets. Pockets. But really cute dress okay and this one um, it was actually you know I think this really cheap um, this one was uh, $69 all their denim is so expensive if you don't get it on sale but they did have 30% off and if you use your gap card I believe you got an extra 20% off so those are the things that I picked up today and um, I'm trying to think what I should do next. I know I mentioned in my first video that I would do, or I was thinking about doing a, um, what is it called? An activewear, um, Nike, Adidas. Um, I have a lot of stuff uh, that I would like to show you guys and to show how you can be plus size but still fit like, you know, an extra large in athletic wear. Um, Adidas runs a little big so I can um, sometimes get in a large. But I think that will be my next video. Thank you for watching. Please uh, subscribe to my channel. Like and of course comment. And you guys have a great week. Take care. Bye.